There'll be no classes today at Southeast Raleigh High School. Students, staff, and families will be taking the time to process an unthinkable incident. There are stabbing that happened less than 24 hours ago. One student is dead. Another is in the hospital. A third is charged with murder. WRL's Kelsey Coffee is live outside the school this morning. Kelsey, school leaders are offering resources to students who feel they need support after what happened there. Jeff, grief counseling will be available for students here at Southeast Raleigh High School after that tragic day. Take a look at this video that was sent to WREL of the incident. It shows dozens of students in a hallway. You can see one student throwing a punch. We're stopping the video before the student in the red hoodie pulls out a knife. The fight then spills into the gym where more students get involved. We pause the video again when the student in the red hoodie starts swinging the knife. Sherelle McLaughlin says it was her 14-year-old son who had the knife. He's now charged with murder. She claims he was bullied at school before this incident. And I called the school and I informed them of that that morning because I told them that something may happen. I don't know. And we're working to find out the names of the student who was killed and the student who was injured. And coming up in the next half hour, you'll hear from a mother of a student who goes here. And she says she's afraid to send her daughter to school. Kelsey Coffey, WRL News, live in Raleigh.